What's up you guys? Welcome to another Python tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you about strings and I'm going to teach you a bunch of cool stuff on the side too. So stay tuned. So uh, let's create a variable called x x equal to the string. You can name your string whatever you want. I'm going to call my string Mohammed. Um, yep and so um, and let's print x. I'm going to teach you everything that you need to know. Um, so of course you guys know if I run this uh, program real quick it would print Muhammad but you already know that so what's what's the problem. So you guys whatever is surrounded by quotes like that is is considered to be a string in Python. And what I want to teach you specifically is this. What, it, uh, what if you want to print the first letter or the second letter or the third letter instead of like printing the whole thing? So what you can do is this. Square brackets and then if you put zero, it would print the first letter because this is how computers uh, work or function or think. I don't know how you want to call that. M is considered zero. O is considered 1, H is considered 2, and so on and so on. So the first letter is M is not considered 1, it's considered 0. So if I run this program, it said, okay, in X, take the first letter, which is 0, and print it out. So if you run this, it, would, it should print M. Um, what if you put 1, then it should print the second letter, which is O. So if you run this, it printed O, as you can see. Um, and you're telling me, okay, that's cool, but what if you want to print a specific um, characters in your string? Uh, in, your, uh, in your string, all you have to do is this: choose where do you want to start. I want to start with zero, and then choose where you want to end. I want to end at two. So if you run this program, it should print 0, which is M, and 1, which is O, and then stop. So it should print Mo. You run this, Mo. So I hope you guys can get the basic idea of how you can control um, the outputs of a string. And uh, yeah, you guys just play around with it. And there's one, th one last thing that I want to teach you is this. If you didn't have anything, like just a colon, sorry, just a colon, and you run this, it would do the same thing um, like if, uh, if there was nothing there from the first place. Like if you run this, it would print Muhammad. So if you run it, boom, Muhammad. But, but if you take that out and run it, it, it would just give you an error, you know? It's just saying, oh, what are you doing, you know? Stop it. So, uh, yeah. So make sure that there's something in there. Um, so this is your quick tutorial on how to how to deal with strings, and uh, you've learned that whatever is surrounded uh, between quotations is considered a string in Python, and you've learned how to output specific um, characters in a string. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in future tutorials. Peace out.